Ooh, no instructions, just go. Oh, there's a person right there. So it's like the obstacle course, except, ooh, there's a lot of people. Oh my god, there's a third person. Oh, there's a fourth. Oh my god! Ah, there's a fifth! Ah. Oh, wait, I just had them snipe each other. That, that was kind of cool. Um, what? No, wait, ooh, there's another person, huh? What's up, guys? And welcome back to another episode of Sneaky Sasquatch. And we are finally done with all of the storylines. As you can see, we have this super cool outfit that actually fits us. And we basically have freedom to do whatever we want. So, first things first. Uh, last episode, I ended off with saying I was going to try to do some of the taxi missions. Like I said, I thought I saw something about it in town. And ooh, the spaghetti hotline. The cashier is gold, so which means there's probably a ton of money in here. Look at that. Look at all these coins. It was definitely a good investment. And there's still more we can do here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All of that. Let's see. What does he want? Oh yeah, the gas range. But last time, we could not do this because we did not have enough money. But now, we can give him 2000 to improve the business. And wow, the business is really starting to kick off. We just earned a ton of money from that. But uh, another thing I wanted to do, actually, I want to head over here. Because now that we don't have to advertise uh as mayor we can actually remove one of the billboard advertisements one of them is helping us with the spaghetti business but we actually we can check the phone book here let's see we have all of these things but i don't know which one has the spaghetti business on it um let's see 2891 let's try 8162 so 555-2451 let's see 555 Two, four, five, one. Hopefully this isn't the one with the spaghetti business on it, but we can remove it. So let's just check if it is first of all. So let's call it. Why is it taking them so long to pick up? Yep, there we go. Yep, no. We want to make some changes. Let's see. Yeah, no, this one is not the one that has um the things on it, I guess. So, 555-2451, five, 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 and we can cancel our advertisement because, like I said before, we don't need to advertise ourselves as mayor, but we want to keep the other one. So yeah, let's cancel the advertisements, and that is it, let's put this back. And another thing I'm going to do is actually insert some coins into my bank accounts. This morning he was running low, we have maybe about 200 left, so a thousand should cover it for quite a while into that card i don't exactly remember my pin um probably something stupid like one two three four but yeah there we go so let's deposit one thousand and perfect so now let's head over to where uh let's see what was i going to do oh yes i was going to check out the taxi area and i think i just saw a mushroom over there yes i did do that actually that was a pretty good catch just like this and yeah we've gotten this one before it's the fly a jerk um yeah so let me just go search around for the taxi person this might be a while but i'm almost 100 percent sure that that taxi person was in town somewhere oh it actually wasn't too bad i think i found them right here um there he is yeah hey there sonny have you got yourself a taxi license um, no we have not. Come back when you've got one then, because I've got a pretty sweet opportunity. You can apply for a taxi permit at the town hall, if you're interested. Cause that guy talks super slow, what the heck. But, he has got a pretty sweet deal for us apparently. So now we need to apply for a taxi permit at the town hall. Uh, let's go in here. I think we may have tried this before, I don't exactly remember. But, wait a minute. Actually, I just realized something. We are the mayor. Uh, yeah, so let's head up to the top floor because we're the mayor. Oh, uh, is there anything we can do here? I completely forgot about that. Yeah. Welcome to your new office, Mayor Justin SS fan, and congratulations on winning the election. We were wondering when you'd finally show up. Please introduce yourself to the town advisor. They're waiting in your office. Everyone's excited to see all the improvements you're going to make. Oh, okay, pretty cool. And what's this? Hello, Mayor Justin SS fan. 
I forgot to mention it earlier, but the town has a special outfit just for the mayor. The only problem is, it's missing a very important piece, a black antique top hat. If you could bring me one, I could get a replica made, and then the outfit would be yours. Mm hmm. Like the top hat, like the one Mr. Pemberton wears? Um, I don't really remember seeing that anywhere, but that's interesting, and yeah, here's our office area, and here are all of our advisors. This is the town planner. Hi, Jason's s fan. I'm the town planner. I cannot be modified the town to fit your vision. The town doesn't have a big budget, so we haven't been able to do any projects for a long time. But if you could contribute some funding, you could really make the town look beautiful. Do you want to make some changes to the town? Okay, interesting. Let's see how much it costs. Maybe if it's only like 500 or something like that. Let's see. Oh! The town is free! So yeah, we can customize all of the colors and everything. Look at this! That's actually super cool. Uh, let's change it to maybe a cool blue-ish theme. Let's see, that looks pretty good. As for this, um, ooh. Didn't expect all of it to be one color, but I suppose if that to all be one color. Um, this, this one look terrible. Don't question my fashion choice, guys. Now uh, what's this? Oh, dude, those are the highlights in the window. Interesting. I'd say, yeah, that looks pretty good there. And now, as for the interior. Um, yeah, we can change all the colors of this. What is this right now? Oh, it's the marble. Dude, look at this. It looks really cool, actually. This, like, um, cyanish marble. I really like that. And this looks like it would be the carpet. Yeah, it's the, that's the carpet. Here looks pretty good, and these are just the walls it looks like. Um, let's see. Just like that. That looks really good, I like that a lot. And we can even change the text here. Instead of Town Hall, um, let's just put it for just a gaming fan here. I rule this town now, and we can even change that highlight here, wow. Um, I don't know if anything like this, this looks kind of weird. Actually, this looks way better than that would. Okay, that's it. And the interior looks great as well. Alright, and what is next? Oi, quick office. Is that 10,000 coins? What? Who would pay that much just to change the colors? What? All of this stuff is 10,000. The arcade, the coffee shop, the supermarkets. Oh, you can customize the entire town. That'd be so cool. But it's way too expensive. 10,000 coins? Everything's 10,000 coins. Oh, but this one's only 2,500. But those are just the street lights. And the fire hydrant's 2,500 as well. We can't afford anything here. I guess the town hall is free. That's something. And what are these other people? Hi, just the Zest fan. I'm your advisor for all things related to transportation. We'll get along fine as long as you don't cut back on my fun. I think my fun would be regrettable. <laughs> oh, buddy, I have like no money. You and Evelyn get some transportation projects. Alright then. Um, okay, these are a little bit less expensive, but still 3500 just to, I guess, change the colors. Maybe there's a couple other things you can do that I don't know about. But okay, this is the only thing we can afford, but I'm not spending 1500 just to change the color of the stop signs. And the speed limit is 5,000. But you barely see any speed limit signs. What's that gonna do? Okay, well, sorry, buddy. But I have, like, no money. And what was this smelly guy doing here? The sanitation commissioner. Hi, Justin says, fam. I'm in charge of all of the dumpsters. You smell great today. Are you wearing a new cologne? No, I'm not, actually. Well, it smells fantastic. Don't change a thing. Do you want to look at some sanitation projects? Uh, all right, then. Probably going to be extremely expensive. But yeah, here's the trash cans. 2500 for the trash cans, really? And same for the dumpsters. All right, pretty cool, but I think this is just something for players who are, what is it? Who've played for a very long time just to splurge on because I, like, no. 10,000? <sighs> Maybe there's some better way to get money, but as for now, 10,000 is way too much. I cannot imagine ever getting that much. But the goal right here... I remember it was to actually go to floor 2, that's where the permits are I believe, yeah here we are, the permits, welcome to the permits department, right now we are only accepting applications for taxi license permits, 
please take a number and i'll hope you when it's your turn we're quite busy as you can see uh i would not agree but all right we're number 20 in line what but there's only a couple people here dang it that's a little bit annoying oh well just change the nine so it's not too slow oh what's this guy doing here Ah, oh, jeez, how did I get number 76? It's not even busy here. Oh, dang, you got number 76. Oh, feels pretty bad, man. But still, okay, there's 10. It shouldn't take too long, but we're number 20. So that's not something to, you know... What is it? To be too happy about either. But we can head over here. This, like, the office area. Guys, we, we work here. Oh, no, guys, it's iCorp all over again. Hey, can we talk to any of these people, or are they just... Okay, they're just working on the computers and stuff. Okay, 12. Yeah, this is... This is not great. They're, they're making us wait, like, a lot. Alright, well... Uh, there's not much to do. I guess we can eat a little thing... Something here. It's a pretty nice design for a table. But, I mean, come on, guys. Why are you gonna make us wait this long? Wow, alright, this is gonna take a while, but with the power of editing, you guys won't have to wait at all. Alright, waiting wasn't terrible, and we're number 20 right here. Yep, welcome to the permits department. Thank you for waiting so patiently. Unfortunately, we are now closed for the day. What? Dang it. Uh, <laughs> just kidding. We like to have fun here in the permits department. Oh, okay, bro. I thought you waited that long for nothing. I'll need you to fill out some paperwork for me real quick. Make sure to follow the instructions. Incorrect information can result in delays or even jail time. Ooh, okay. Um, class B license. Um, I honestly don't remember if we have it, but we're, eh, we're just gonna say we have it. Okay, we definitely do own a vehicle. Years of experience. Uh, we'll just say 10. You know, that makes sense, right? And no criminal record? Yeah, totally. Uh, yeah, uh-huh, signature, Th there we go. Hmm, are you sure you filled this out correctly? Uh, yes. Well, it's not my job to validate these things. I just get the paperwork signed and hand out the permits. But I don't see my supervisor around, so why don't we skip right to the approval process? Your application is approved. Nice, okay. We now have the taxi permit. Take that to the instructor over at the racetrack and you'll be qualified to earn your taxi license. Okay, so we, all we have is the permit. Now we need to earn the license over at the racetrack. Um, with a super fast car though, that should be no problem at all. Alright, we've arrived at the racetrack with really no problem here. Um, wait, no, not over here. We have to go in here. And I know we gotta take a number in line here. He, this guy falls asleep, of course. <laughs> Even though he's a friend now. I believe we had this guy as a friend. Come on. Yep, there we go. So, yeah, the taxi license test. There's only one lap, so, I mean, let's do it. Hopefully, it's not too hard. To pass this test, you'll have to pick up two passengers and take them to the drop off zone. To pick up a passenger, come to a complete stop nearby and they'll come over. To drop someone off, come to a complete stop once you've arrived at the destination. Oh, and one more really important thing. I just had my clones polished the other day, so do not scuff them up. Of course. Alright, okay, let's get moving. So we're in a truck here. I guess we can hold more people, that makes sense. So yeah, we have to come to a complete stop. Yeah, this is just like picking up friends. I need to get to the drop-off zone right away. Can you give me a ride? Sure. Let's get going. If you start driving dangerously, I'll give you a bad rating. Oh, so we have to drive, like, slowly, maybe? I'm not sure what they mean. I guess we'll see what rating we have at the end. But then most important thing, don't scuff off the coins or the cones, sorry. And, yeah, we gotta pick up this other person. Okay, yep, yeah, get in. Where do you need to go? To the drop-off zone as well? Yep, to the drop-off zone, right away, we can give you a ride, yep, so we'll just drive slowly, maybe not too crazily, because we do not want to start driving dangerously, because then they'll give us a bad rating, right here, just like that, trip completes, and we actually got 25 points from that, not too bad, and a 5 star rating, congratulations, so now we have our taxi license, so I guess we can just pick up people now. Yep, here is our test, and we passed the test, unlocked the taxi license. Well, that's pretty nice. 
Um, we'll head over to the town tomorrow, I guess. Because it may be getting a little bit late today. But what I do want to do, see if we've completed all the races. We actually, have we? Yeah, we've actually done all of the races. Which, I'm pretty sure... Whoa, 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 maybe I'm, maybe I'm on something. One of these people was at this person. We got lucky, yeah. Didn't this person say something about beating all of the events? Or am I just... Oh, yeah. So, good thing I checked that, actually. Whoa, I can't believe you actually did it. Well, I promise you give me my... I promise I give you my racing outfits. I really didn't think this through. What? Dude, look, we look so cool now. We're pro racer. Okay, that is pretty epic there. Let's see. Um, another thing that I've always wanted to do. Well, okay, okay. We just did get the taxi license and all of that. So we may as well start with that. However, it is getting a little bit late. So what I think I'm going to do is head back home. And tomorrow, we should be able to check out the taxi license. And maybe pick up some people and earn some extra coins. Oh. I just saw mushroom guys. You always have to have a keen eye for mushrooms. I don't know if you've actually gone this one before. It's the more mushroom. But there's a ton we've gone. Like I said, I do want to head over to... What is it? To the mushroom hut at some point. So we can cash in all of those. But for now, yeah, let's head over to the taxi driver and see what he has to say. What surprise was it? Alright, right here. Hey there, Sunny. Have you got yourself a taxi license? We do indeed. I've got quite an opportunity for you, if you're interested. I'm looking to retire from the business, but I want to pass my uh, pass my taxi onto someone who will appreciate it. This baby can hold four passengers at once, so you can maximize your revenue. To prove you're worthy of handling these wheels, you'll need to get your average taxi rating to four stars or higher. Once you've done that, come see me. Oh, so there's a taxi rating now. I bet we can check that in the settings, but I think I've seen something. Taxi rating 5.0 because of that permit. But what I'm going to do, um, I'm pretty sure ramming in the cars and stuff is not considered safe driving. So what I'm going to do is get a truck because although this can only hold three passengers, well, technically four, including me. But, yeah, I think we can pick up, pick up literally anyone we want. We can pick up a ton of people at once, actually. So, yeah, this person needs to get to the racetrack right away, and they'll pay, they'll pay $80. Okay. And now we can get going, and we have to drive very carefully. Maybe on actually the right side of the road. Uh, let's pick up anyone else we see. For example, this person right here. See where this person needs to go. Okay, the lumber mill. Wow, 143, that's actually a lot of coins. Uh, yeah, let's give them a ride, so let's be driving way more carefully this time. Alright, thanks for the ride. No problem. So, this is actually going to be pretty difficult. Not hit anyone, I've never driven like this, and we are so slow. But we definitely don't want to hit anyone, otherwise a taxi rating will go down. And we need one of four stars or higher. And I assume we'll have to do multiple um, taxi rides as well because ours is, was already higher than four stars. I don't know exactly how many we have to do. Maybe he mentioned it. But yeah, I think we're going to get five stars. He's commenting on what a smooth ride it is. But yeah, as I was saying before, I bet like there's a minimum number of rides that we have to do to get our taxi rating up. But so far, this actually isn't too bad. There's not too many cars on the road. This inner section, though, might be a problem. Although, there's actually another person right here. Yep, you can come up here. Let's see. Oh, the race check, that's perfect. Only 25 for that, but that is fine. All right, boys, come on. We're almost to the race track. And here we are. Can you guys get out here? Oh, yep, there we go. Trip completes 80 points. So nice. And as for this person, they need to make it to the lumber mill. And what that is. No! Whoa, what was that? Oh, I'm sorry. Dang it. So I think a taxi rating just went down because of that. 
Ooh, I'm sorry, buddy, but I was actually... That was a pretty hard collision. But, okay, we can just take you to the lumber mill now. Alright, no more problems after that. Can we just stop here? Or, no, I guess we have to go a little bit further. And they did want to make it to the Star Mountain, right? Or was it the Ski Mountain? I'm not 100% sure anymore. But I'm pretty sure it was the Star Mountain. Um, yep, there we go. And, okay, only four stars for that. But still, that's a good amount of coins. We can grab that one. So, not too bad. Um, our taxi rating still should be fine. But, here, I'm actually going to head to the Ski Mountain. Because, first of all, there's probably going to be some passengers over there. And second of all, we can actually finish up those snowball events. Because, the what is it? Those are actually my favorite events so far. They're definitely the most fun of all the sports you can do. And there are still a couple more that we need to do. So, yeah. Time to do the ski. Yep, as I suspected, there is a taxi... A uh, person that needs to be picked up, but as I said before, uh, I'm not going to do that quite yet Instead, I'm actually going to ski over to where the snowball events are because the ski mountain is actually a pretty obscure place So while we're over here, like I said, I'm going to do my favorite sports Snowball fighting so we've won most of the events. Oh uh, Well, we accidentally entered practice and there actually is a mushroom right there. We should grab that later But for now, let's just exit Okay, yeah, let's try that again. Oh, what are you doing, Sasquatch? Yeah, there we go. So, yeah, we are. So, yeah, we've been the Snowball, the Snowball Royale, the Team Battle, the Time Trial, the Skiing Time Trial, but not the Obstacle Course or Survival. That one gives 500. But now, let's just do the Obstacle Course. We get 200 for winning this one. Get to the finish area without being hit by snowballs. Oh, so this is like a dodging one. So, oh, there's a person right there. Oh, they don't, oh, I get it, I get it. You gotta have some crazy dodging skills here. And oh, there's so many people. Ooh, dodges. Ah, there's another person. Oh, run into the snow forts. Okay, okay. A little bit of chill time here, but there's another person. We'll try to dodge them. Yep. Okay, this person's super slow at throwing, so I bet we can sneak around here just like that. Oh, he almost sniped me. That was super lucky. Barely missed him. There's another person now. Seriously. Why are there so many people? How am I supposed to dodge all of this? Oh no, it's another person. Oh, we just got sniped. Sorry. I'm just going to have to tank that. Come on, but the goal's right there. Oh, that was so close. But we are the winner. We survived with one heart left. That was a little more intense than I wanted it to be. And we got it. 200 coins for that. We're slowly gaining back all the coins that we lost from buying that gear from the fox. But alright, the last one that we need now is survival. We get 500 for this. Let's see how difficult it's going to be. Oh, no instructions, just go. Oh, there's a person right there. So it's like the obstacle course, except, oh, there's a lot of people. Oh my god, there's a third person. Oh, there's a fourth. Oh my god, ah, there's a fifth. Ah. Oh, wait, I just had them snipe each other. That, that was kind of cool. Um, what? No, wait, oh, there's another person, huh? Eh? Guys, 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 run. How many people are there? No! Please don't snipe me. Please don't snipe me. Thank you. Dude, there's so many people. We need to have them, like, kill each other. Or oh, not kill each other, just hit each other. So, yeah, we, got, we want to get a little bit closer so they throw their snowballs. Hopefully at each other, because that is how we got them last time. But, oh, yeah, there is a time limit. So, yeah, let's just keep running. Oh, dude, they're so much slower than I am, but look at this. It's like a horde. It is a horde of people. And one snowball could end my entire career. I think I'm just gonna run. Like at this point, no more game. Oh no. Why? Please. No! It's a fail. 0.33 seconds left. Seriously. Fine, fine, fine. But we know where this goes now. Like just immediately head to the right. Wow, okay. But this there's people surrounding from all sides at the beginning is the thing. Oh no, guys, this is, even good. this is gonna be even worse than last time. Come on, if we just can get out of here with two hearts. Yes! Okay, now this person's gotta get out. Dodge. Yep. I haven't hit each other, boys. I haven't hit each other. Yep, okay, there's someone right there. Dodges. Crazy dodges. 
go a little bit. Okay, guys, guys, guys. This is actually kind of intense, but we have two hearts this time. Oh, oh. Okay, guys, yep. We should be fine. We should be fine. Someone up there, though. And please see there's not someone left behind here like last time. Yes, there's no. Yep. This, this has to be it. We're fine. We're fine. We can just chill here, and then when they catch up, we are out. Yep. Nice. We are the winner. Let's go. And 500 for that. Not bad. Not bad at all here. And we get 500 for that. Ooh. It is getting super late though, much later than I expected. Um, so I'd say let's just head home. Or to our apartment. Well guys, I don't know if we even need the apartment anymore, although... Eh. Yeah, I don't think we need the apartment anymore. Because before we just did that because we had to work at the port. But now, I mean, the town is a pretty useful place, I will say. But we have a super fast car if we ever need to get there. And we need all the coins we can get. So let's talk to the vental agent here. Well, hello there. You want to take a look at one of the other apartments? Sorry, buddy. Yes, we want to start renting our apartments. I'm sorry to hear that. I'll process the paperwork right away. All right. Well, that is it for now. So yeah, it's super late right now. And I've been recording for a while. So for now... Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.